Hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Stained nails. What do I do? Here are my nails. They are wicked stained. So I'm going to show you how to clean these up a little bit. I'll be using the Blue Cross Cuticle Remover. I put it in a little jar with a brush. I've got my curette tool and my um, cuticle pusher. And that's all I'm going to be using, really. So I like to brush it on all of the nails. Just kind of let it sit and do its thing. And I've shown this on my videos before. Um, you know, I think it's about a once a year thing that I like to show it. And then I go back to the first nail that I put the cuticle remover on. And then I start with my cuticle pusher. Kind of scrape across the whole nail, especially up by the cuticle area. And then I scrape the opposite direction down towards the tip across the whole nail. I know it's kind of hard to see with my big fat hand up in the way. But this, um, this is just how I do it. And once I do that, I like to use my curette. I use the big end first. Sometimes I use a little end. Sometimes I don't. A curette has a little cup on the end of it. And it's um, kind of like running a spoon across everything. And it helps get that stuff, you know, moving. Okay, so I wiped it with a paper towel. Now, on this Blue Cross cuticle remover, you do not want to leave it on your nails for a long time. I normally make quick work of this, and I hurry up and do one hand, and I go scrub it clean with some Dawn dish soap, or rather, um, Walmart's version of Dawn dish soap, and um, get, get that product off of my nails so that it doesn't continue to be, you know, eating its stuff, like my nail. <laughs> But you can see that's coming up pretty good. I mean, it's not going to be perfect. If I wanted it perfect, I could have kept going at it, you know. Um, but I don't. I just want to get that cuticle area cleaned up. I want to get some of that staining off my nails. Now, the particular polish that stained my nails this time was the uh, Skyflaw um, Central Perk Couch. But, you know, it's an orange you got to, you know, if you paint your nails a bunch, you know a lot of polishes will do this. And even over time, even if you don't really think that the polishes are staining, over time they do. And I normally don't care about staining because I'm going to slap some more nail polish on my nails anyway. But I do occasionally like to get them cleaned up in case I feel like doing some kind of negative space or something like that for a manicure. And also, you know, I really don't like filming really grody yellow nails. I mean, to me, this just, they're gross. Ugh. But I do understand it. You know, I've been doing this for a really long time. And um, like I said, for the most part, I just, you know, paint over it. I don't, I don't even worry about it. You can see also at the very tips, there's like, it looks like major staining. That's actually just polish that's underneath. I had not cleaned that up yet because I had on a peel-off base coat. So I just had popped the peel-off off and decided to film this for you and do it for me. Get them nails cleaned. Get them all cleaned up. And, you know, I know it looks like I'm really going at it, but I'm really not applying that much pressure to this. You do what feels comfortable for you. I do recommend going in easy, gentle at first until you get used to it. Um, you know, it's it's definitely one of those things that you, you get, if you do it long enough, you get really good at it and you get comfortable with it. And you look at all that cuticle coming up, all that skin from, and, and polish layers, because you know, even though you think you've gotten all the polish off, I really believe that residuals from them stay and uh, you know well, obviously it does if it's staining something staying right <laughs> so that's what I do and this is how I do it I do believe down in the description box there is a link to a curette but if you're if, if it's not down there or the links no good anymore just go on Google and type in nail curette um, I, I believe I got mine at Sally's Beauty. I, I don't know. It's been forever in a minute. And, um, so I'm not really sure where I got it. 
So there we go. We got them all clean. I do like to use the pointy thing to clean out the gunk out of my tool before I take it to wash it. I clean out both ends, the little one and the big one. And then I wash them. I take them and wash them all off. And here is what my nails look after I wash my hands. Much better, eh? I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.